The Holy Quran says that Hazrat Yunus salam, was swallowed whole by a fish. Scientists oppose this, as humans cannot hold their breath for a long time. How can we explain that Hazrat Yunus salam, was swallowed by a fish and survived inside it? You see, he, he was swallowed and it is not, the Quran does not say that he kept uh, there in, uh, uh, in the fish belly for three days. It is Bible. Gee. So as soon as he was swallowed by the fish, the fish brought him out. Eh? He did not spend more than some few hours in the, the fish throat or belly or duct, esophagus. So if fish has that one, I don't know the anatomy of the fish. Eh? So anyway, but he did not stay there for a longer period. So even then, Quran says, when he came out from the belly of the fish, he was sick, he was unconscious, and he was injured. And for some time, he was just kept on conscious there. And then after that, you know, he became conscious and survived that bad episode. So, whether scientists, scientists say that because Bible says he, he was, he remained there in the belly of the fish for three days and he cannot survive, he will be also okay, the same, right thing. But we do not believe he remained there for three days. As soon as he was swallowed, he was also brought out. <laughs> Aishat